I came in here on the 19th of uh, November we, because I had a house fire. I was in hospital with smoke insulation and it was Johnny enrolled me and for and I was ill but now I've got better. I was going to upset me. And I've met a lot of friends since I've been here and the staff have been really, really marvellous with me. I do a day before them, been really good. And they're really, really nice. Because I came here with nothing. Came in here with my pyjamas on to the hospital. But they've made me really welcome. I stay and I can't fault them in any way. Do it to be firm. It'd be really, really nice. So that. No, the staff here will help me get a house and whatever. But I don't just want to rush too quick because I feel myself I'm still getting flashbacks to the fire because I can't sleep very good. But other than that, I've been fine because I've been doing brown in here. Just keep myself to myself and all this stuff are really, really nice. No faults with anybody. I think it was my social worker that got me here. No, when I came out for the fire, I went straight home. I got dropped off in a taxi and I went straight to the council. And it was the council worker that got me here. And it is a beautiful building. And I know we're safe. I mean, this is the only one. This is the very first time I've ever been at the hostel. And it's been brilliant. Can't even fault MD in here lives here because they're all nice. No, ah, they're really nice. Can't fault them in any way. And anything you need, you just go down and they'll give you. So obliging. Every one of them. Nalik, the, the manager, he's really nice as well. No, I can't fault any one of the staff. Because I know if I need anything, they'll be there for me. And if I need any help to go anywhere, they'll sort it. And I'm confident in that. Aye, <coughs> right, we're nice. Can't fault them anyway. It's just like a family. I'm happy here. See if I could stay here forever, I would. <laughs> so it's good. <laughs>